हेलो व्यूअर्स इन द लास्ट वीडियो आई मिस्ड आउट अ पॉइंट व्हेन वी डिक्लेयर अ ब्रॉडकास्ट रिसीवर दैट इज इन दिस केस इट इज अलर्ट सर्विस वी हैव टू डिक्लेयर इट एज अ रिसीवर इन अवर एंड्रॉयड मैनिफेस्ट डॉट एक्स एम एल फाइल एंड दिस इज द this is what you have to write alert dot service that is our class name and boot completed i will explain this in a while now let's come back to our main activity button dot now we would create a notific we want to create a notification whenever we press the button or touch the button you can say so we would call on click listener on it now sorry to set the time on which we want to notify the user we would get it through calendar class hour of day when you pass hour of day the calendar sets this value or which was this one this value is passed here and it is set to this hour of day and in the same way we would set minute you have to call calendar dot minute and sorry it was app minute and now in this case our time is set now we have to make an intent object and we will pass our context in this and we would we would call alert service dot class to context application yes it's fine now we will create a pending intent let's declare it as pending intent one pending dot get activity we will pass first our application context then we would pass a request code you can pass any number i would pass zero and then our intent sorry and then we would pass pending intent dot update current what this does is it updates the value of the pending intent and continuously points to the current intent activity now we will create an alarm manager object and this is the way we will we create an alarm manager object sorry reference you can see uh, this starts 
our activity that is alarm that is alert service sorry here it is alert service as an alarm service which would behave as an alarm because we want the user to be notified at a certain point of time as a alarm does so now alarm manager dot there are two things you can call this method or you can call this method but what this method does is it synchronizes with other apps if any other notification is coming at that in a matter of 2-3 seconds or 2-3 minutes as well then this method synchronizes all the and collects all the notifications and sends it as a collection to the user as very collection of various notifications from various other apps so let's see what we have to pass in here Thanks. here we would pass alarm manager.rtc wake up because we want the phone screen to go on when the notification is passed now we the next parameter that we would pass is get calendar dot get current time release what this does is it would start this whole service notification service of this alert service class at this point of time that which we have passed here now another thing we can set any number of methods look here interval day interval 15 minutes interval half day interval half hour but as we are testing this application we could pass one minute that's it this 16,000 milliseconds so the notification would start at this time when the user selects this time and would notify after every one minute if you want the user to be notified after every one day then you would pass interval day if you want to the user to be notified in 15 minutes then interval 15 minutes and so on you would pass 60,000 and the pending end end and that's it in this video we are done and in the next two three videos you will be having your own android project so have fun and practice all this and bye